Welcome back to Cut Above Tarot. Hey, hey, Virgo. Virgo, I hear a song for you. I'm not going to sing it all, but it said, Do you know what today is? It's our anniversary. So it may be your anniversary in the month of June, or it may be your anniversary uh, when you watch this video. However, this video, this message, this reading is for summertime. It is called "What What's Happening This Summer for the Virgo Virgos." All right. So don't forget, please like, share, subscribe, comment, get in where you fit in. If you don't find yourself in this video, Virgo, please check your other placements too. If you're cruising and viewing, all views are appreciated. If you return a subscriber, yay, thank you for coming back to Cut Above Tarot. I love your support. Uh huh. And <clears throat> Without you, there would be no Cut Above Tarot. That's the truth. All right, so let's get started. Now, it looks like that you have... Um, your overall energy, you got your overall energy here, it's talking about your, you uh, standing your ground, all right, being firm about something, okay, all right, look like you say you ain't dealing with no altercations this summer, you ain't trying to be off and all of the extra stuff, all right, mm-hmm, seven of wands, okay, <clears throat> All right, look like you got the money card. Hey, show me the money, honey. Show me the money, 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 money. Yep, yep. Okay, so you got the money. Okay, what the hell? All right, Virgo. You got the money card and you got the widow card. So uh, uh, I clarified the money card. I mean, the widow card and it says nine of swords, okay? All right, look like you're going to be worried. You're going to be not being able to rest, okay? All right. All right, yeah, you're going to be up. Uh, you're going to be having dreams, okay, some nightmares and stuff. Maybe the person, maybe your person uh, passed on, okay, and uh, it's keeping you up at night. And maybe there were some things that you feel like that you should have, you would have got the opportunity to say, or you would should have said, which is causing you now to have these these um, uh, dreams, okay, and worried and troubled in your spirit, so to speak. Yeah, yeah. All right, you got the five of cups here. Now you're concerned about your your place where you live and your stability, okay? Yeah, if you're going to have enough money to take care of this or that and the other. All right, but you also, they said, never fear, don't worry. Now the cups here, okay? You're going to be fulfilled. You're going to be okay, all right? Mm -hmm. They say that the wheel of fortune is turning in your in your favor, okay? They also say that you're going to have some help, all right? Three of Wands, okay? You're going to have some help, okay? Or you're going to have a decision that you have to make in order for you to have this uh, this, uh, this um, new beginning. However, I'm going to read this because we're using a Paulina Tarot deck. And uh, <clears throat> the Three of Wands, okay? And this deck means you're exploring the unknown, okay? you got some new adventures, Okay, that are expanding on your horizon. It says also that you have foresight as well as responsibility. Okay, that's coming your way or what you're getting ready to embark on. Okay, all right. So the meaning again says uh, exploring the unknown and new adventures and expanding horizon. Providing direction, foresight, and responsibilities. Okay, so... That's that's your that's the information that you got on a widow card when it was clarified. So, in other words, you're going to be doing some things by yourself. You're going to be like a lone ranger, so to speak, a, a lone stranger. Anyway, you're going to be a loner. Okay, so you're about to embark on some stuff that you're going to be doing by yourself during the summertime. Okay, during the month of of June. All right. Uh, it might be that you're doing some reminiscing on a relationship that you had in the month of June, okay? And you became a widow during that time. Maybe you were just separated. You ended up being by yourself, all right? Okay, and then there's others of you who are actually having a celebration during the time of June, you know, because this is for summertime or during the summertime, summer season, all right? So congratulations, Okay, and congratulations on uh, all of your success in your, in your endeavors. All right, Virgo? All right, Virgo, you also have uh, a card of reflection, okay? Okay, this is the four flutes. 
All right, they say you're doing some reflection. Okay, what are you reflecting about? Some gossip. All right, something that you heard. Okay, all right, there's some gossip going on about you. What is going on about? Because of a challenge or something that you want. Okay, you might be a track star. All right, you may be a valedictorian, Victorian, you know, when it comes to uh, on high honors, and you was the one that's speaking or going to be speaking. Okay, all right, and and yeah, there's going to be some gossip. Okay, not no bad gossip, look like either. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Yes, indeed. Okay, we have another Virgo here that's, that's possibly going to be sent home from either school or from work because of some kind of headache or something like something like that. Uh, could be worried or something. I'm very concerned. But there is a Virgo that's going to be uh, going home. Okay, and I don't want to. I'm gonna. Leave, I want to leave it right there because the home could also go back and connect with this widow card. Okay. This widow card meaning somebody going home. Okay. So it could be we got a male that's getting ready to go home, you know, going to go what they call the celebration. All right, going to meet the Lord, okay, so to speak, okay, and leaving his female or his significant other as a widow. And if that's the case, uh this widow is also going to be worried about their stability, okay, because you got the five of pentacles here where they live at, you know surrounding that but then you also got the cause here that says okay you got money coming in they saying don't worry all right you got that twice money okay and you got the nine of pentacles okay y'all i can put this out here backwards all right but you you know where i'm going with this right anyway i'm trying to get it right all right see i put the nine of, okay yeah so you have some worry and stuff around this five of pentacles saying that you're concerned about your your stability. They say you got money coming in. All right. Yeah, somebody's going to help you. Three of Wands. You're going to have some collaboration with that as well. Also, there's some choices that you're going to be able to make or have to make. All right. But the Wheel of Fortune says that things are still going in your favor and also that you're going to be fulfilled. All right. Everything going to be working. You're going to be content. Things going to work out in your favor. You're going to be abundant. Okay. You have more money coming in than that you imagined, more than you thought you was going to get. Okay, Virgo, uh, all right, or uh, somebody with Virgo in their chart, okay, yeah, it's going to cause you also to have uh, a celebration, okay, you're going to have people that's going to be gossiping also about it, all right, yeah, and uh, however, you're going to be, either you're going to be doing some reflecting or they're going to be reflecting, you know, about some things that happened or took place or they seen or they heard, you know, all right, prior to you becoming this person that is abundant now, pertaining to the death of somebody. Okay. Okay. It could have been somebody that was married that, that was a widow before they died. Okay. But they turned around and left money for you. Mm -hmm. All right. So that sounds like it could have been a parent. A parent left you some finances. Okay. They threw in a will. All right. Let's see what else got for over here for uh, you, Virgo. Virgo, they said they want you to ground yourself. This is Earth Element card. All right, ground yourself. You know, take your walk outside in the, in the uh in the park or something somewhere where there's a lot of uh foliage, greenery. Okay, plants. Okay, play off in your garden. Go out there and plant you something. I don't know what you're gonna plant. Plant some seeds. Plant some oranges. Plant some lemon trees. Just plant some hell. You know what I'm saying? Plant some. Mm -hmm. Yeah, put your hands out there in in the, in the dirt. I, 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 yeah, you can use gloves, too, if that's what you choose to. Or walk around in your backyard, you know, in your socks. You know, if you've got a problem with anything being on the bottom of your feet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you, you, go hug your tree. Yeah, I heard that one. Okay. All right. But, yeah, go, you need to ground yourself, okay? All right? So you can make some sound uh, decisions, Okay. Okay. All right, Virgo, I guess that's all I got for you, baby. I don't know what else to tell you. I don't know what else to tell you. Mm-hmm. All right, you please like, share, subscribe, and comment. I'll be back to do another video just for you, Virgo. Yeah, yeah. And other grounds, other, other, other signs too, right? All right.